Busy students often look for new ways to get a quick workout in between classes, schoolwork, and outside activities. But BU senior Claire Richer has taken a step further and is using those burned calories as an alternative to burning fuel. I feel like climate change is something that I'm, is the most pressing issue of our day. If we don't have our planet, we, you know, the way we're treating our planet, we won't have one to live on that's, that is suitable for human life. It started last year when she went to a Divest BU meeting and saw that the entire meeting had been taken off the grid. And it was charged by a bike, like a regular old bike with a generator. Instead of the end of the meeting, wouldn't it be cool if this was an everyday thing? What if this room was always taken off the grid? The bikes provide up to 150 watts. The average person can generate 100 without breaking a sweat. So a 13-inch MacBook Pro is 75 watts, a 15-inch MacBook Pro is 85 watts. Um, your phone is 5. It might be easy to power your laptop or phone, but something like a microwave can take up to 1,000 watts. However, even the small effort is worth it. Changing a light bulb is a drop in the bucket. Any single action that anyone does is a drop in the bucket. So really, it's about whether it can scale. Claire hopes to empower others to actively make a difference on their own. Well, to you know, say that, okay, I'm doing this one thing that's going to help in my little way, I think is really empowering. Reporting for BU News at Noon, I'm Lauren Westberg.